This is The Close-Up, conversations about creativity. From the studios of the Beijing Film Academy in Beijing, China, here is Jim Chapin. How is the technical capability of the crews in China versus what you work with in London or Hollywood on a big blockbuster? Well, from a production standpoint, I would say they're pretty much almost on the same level with Western crews. There's, you know, minor, minuscule differences, but they're not, they're, they don't add up to like a big difference, I would say. But where the big difference for me comes is still in the post-production side. That's, that's where I see most of the issues in China, honestly. So when you're working here and you've been assigned to come here to, to make a movie, is language an issue for you or are you able to communicate and how do you do that? Um, you know, in Hong Kong films, it's been easier to be honest. Um, there's, you know, at least above the line people, the directors, the producers, the cinematographer, those guys I have no issues communicating with, but when it comes to, comes to below the line, camera crew, some of them, you know, it's very difficult to communicate with. It works out in the end. When you're looking to bring people on to work for you, what do you look for? Well, first of all, I think the most important one is passion. If you don't have passion in what you're doing, then it's maybe not the right thing for you. So I think passion first and foremost, dedication. Someone we both admire tremendously, Ang Lee, who just finished shooting yeah. Billy That's Lynn's right. long halftime walk in Atlanta with a friend of ours, Dimitri Portelli, uh, in 3D, high frame rate, 120 frames per second, digital. Are we looking at a future where if you're working in this industry and you want to work in this industry, you're going to be working on a lot of different palettes? You, you mentioned Ang Lee, who does not come from the generation, but yet he experiments and like tries new things, which is exciting. And then you have this new generation of filmmakers who are just entering and they grew up in the digital realm. For them, film is something, you know, they probably might not have seen. Some of them do in film school, you still do some film, but in general, I think it's gonna produce a lot of interesting content with people that come from that sort of background and have digital sort of in the blood and, you know, are able to maybe open up and experiment more, or have been experimenting their whole life with digital. The Close Up is produced by the Advanced Imaging Society in Hollywood and powered by Barco.